Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is Hello. Uh, it's going good. Glad to be here. Uh, How has it been on the festival circuit this year? I know you were on one last year as well. You were at Lollapalooza yeah. among others, but how's it going this go around? It's going good. This one, it's feeling a lot heavier. Like we were doing in a good way. Like we we were we were doing uh, festivals, but everything was kind of spaced out and like I don't know. People were like they were just doing all these guidelines. Like festivals didn't feel like they were happening like this, but now they're like happening everywhere and they're happening like heavy. So nice. Um, it's. It's tiring, to be honest, but it's really good, really fun, good energy everywhere. Um, yeah, it's it's amazing to like be playing all these shows, and this is, I mean, essentially like my first festival run, um, other than kind of last year, um, and it's amazing like to be playing these sets. It's just it's an honor. Yeah, yeah, it's awesome, and it's taken you obviously all over the country. I know you're going to Australia as well in this in this yeah, summer, um, yeah. but favorite part about louisville so far um if you've been here oh my gosh well i kind of got in at like midnight last night um but everybody's been really nice, nice. it's really pretty the weather's nice so that's all you need in a can't place really, yeah. yeah can't really ask for anything more yeah your band members are they originally from chicago or are they from like all over the place um just one so okay. nori who plays keys um he is from St. Louis, but lived in Chicago for a little bit, um, and was in like the post-animal world uh, of people. So yeah, cool. Yeah, cool guys. Being from Texas, did you find the rest of your band members? Did you just? Um, I went to the University of Texas for a year in Austin. Um, so yeah, I mean, most of my friends kind of came through college, but yeah, they're. Everybody else is a Texas native other than Nori, um, but we kind of come from all over. So, yeah. biggest influences is in terms of in terms of my sound. sound. Um, man, I don't know. Let's think. I feel like I'm always kind of changing my sound. Um, I love Paul Simon. Like I think when I really analyze what inspires me. Lyrically and sonically, I get a lot from Paul Simon. Um, Paul Simon, Graceland era. I mean, kind of. But I also love, like, Phoenix, um, you know, Tame Impala-ish every once in a while. Um, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Lot, so I was just yeah. curious because... Roosevelt vibe. Sometimes I get Phoenix. Oh yeah, Paul Roosevelt. Simon. Yeah, yeah. So I, I'm just curious. How does it feel sharing a bill with Tame Impala? You just mentioned them. Oh, it's crazy. Nice. Yeah, I mean, he's definitely on the festival circuit right now too. Um, so they're just doing so many shows. So we've gotten to see their set a couple times, um, which has been so fun. It's just like so inspiring as a producer, just how dialed in their whole show is, um, stage production wise. So it's really cool to watch. Huge fan. Um, yeah, it's cool. Do you mainly do your own stuff, or are you available for other people as well? Um, I'm pretty busy right now, Depends. but all with my own stuff. Um, but I would like to be available for other people. That's something I hope to do soon, um, is once my schedule kind of frees up, um, then I can start to work with other people. That would be really fun. Hmm. Um. Man, I, I don't know. I guess it depends on the context. Like, Paul McCartney did that whole like reimagined thing where he like got artists to work on his own songs. I mean, I'd like to work with Paul McCartney. Maybe that'd be cool. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Over a year at this point, but. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling about it? I'm feeling good. Um, yeah, I mean, there's just been so many, like, obstacles for everyone in the world lately. And so rolling out music hasn't been traditional, which I don't have any context for that. So, like, 
I don't know what traditional means. I've never had a traditional rollout. So I'm having fun with it. And, like, it hasn't, like, yeah, it's just been extremely fun. Um, but I am working on new music. And uh, I'll be playing a new song today. Yeah, which is going to be fun. Um, but I'll be putting music out this summer, which I'm really stoked about. Yeah. Did you see? Total. It's pretty different. I, I like. It's very day glow, and I think it'll make total sense when people hear it. Um, but it's really imaginative in a pop sense. Like, it's not. Like I don't take any musical tangents, um, but I try to be really creative in making pop songs. And um, I'm really proud with how this record turned out doing that. It's probably the most I can say for now, but yeah, it's like it's very dancey and really high energy and fun. Oh, cool. Brooklyn, Nashville, how was that? Amazing. I love that venue. Yeah, whole staff was great. Whole, like, the whole thing was nice and clean. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of like a clean freak, so it's hard to go to, like, venues all the time because, you know, there's history and so much fun, like, going to venues, but a lot of them are clean, and Brooklyn Bowl, like, they're on top of it. It's nice. You know, it's new, but, yeah, I, and, I, and I love Nashville, so. But would you say you have a favorite city in the region? Obviously, obviously you're going to be biased about Texas. Yeah. But that would be okay. Favorite. I mean, I love Austin. I love. Uh, I love Louisville. Yeah, yeah, Kentucky. Yeah. Oh man. Who would win? Probably a tiger, right? Maybe. Kangaroos got kicks. They do. <laughs> they do. I'll go with tiger, though. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. What is he like every you as a person and how they can best you know, get the word out and let people know? Yeah, I guess come to a show. You might like it, you might not. Um, I'm biased, I hope you would. Uh, I make my music myself, uh, I tour with my friends, and it's just all around a fun thing. Um, I try to make honest music, I love making music. Um, yeah, just trying to keep, uh, keep music alive, I guess, so, yeah. Looking forward to your set at Boom later. Yeah, thank you.